No Man's Sky? No Man's Sky never changes. As you can see, I'm still floating three feet above my fucking chair. But hey, the teleporter went to the corner that I told you I didn't want it to go in. And there it is. And I have to say, I don't hate it. Uh, all it did was move the furniture that was there. I had a plant that I set down and another implement and it's gone. But look at this. It fixed my build opportunity. So even though this one didn't do anything, nor did it make any sense, and there was no, like, effect when I claimed it, I was able to claim it. So now my my, my town's working again, uh, which is, for me, was the biggest deal. Uh, I personally had no issues until 6, 3.65. Uh, if you want the patch notes, like the details, check out my previous video where I literally showed the patch notes. Uh, but so far, biggest things were the, uh, you know, variety of fixes. And then uh, they added the teleporter to the office. It's in the opposite corner from the terminal. Uh, personal note, I think they should have just added a section in the menu for it. And you could just access it from there. You know, a teleport menu from the console. Uh, oh yeah, my 100% sentinels went off apparently. So, uh, finally, got that going too. So I guess if you were stuck on anything sentinel or op related, hopefully you're fixed now. I'm um, 100% certain that I'm going to see somebody somewhere if not a hundred people somewhere say, you know, oh, this game sucks, I'm tired of this game, it broke my game, my save died, oh, I, my building is broke, I can't do this. That's, every time they change something or fix something, that's all I see online is a bunch of fucking babies crying about how the game that they used to work on doesn't work anymore, and now they're never going to play it again, but here they are online talking about how they're not going to play it again. I don't know, it's always confusing to me when people do that sort of thing it's like okay if you don't want to play don't play but uh, the game's not broke it's just getting better and sometimes if you don't understand how complex this game is behind the scenes oh my god like oh speaking of oh my god uh, these fucking geck showed up what is this what is this, this fucking stubby little scaly beaked bastard dancing in my club and then here was another one are these visitors are they residents that got changed uh, I've seen other people mentioning that they have you know more people in their call in their settlement than they had as not number wise but like type wise and I was always thinking just like a few of the other things like uh, what I'm about to show you now they added the traitor and the galactical galactic terminal to the uh, to the shops if you build a shopping center you'll now have a vendor and a terminal in there and that was something I was saying it felt like it should have been there and the same goes for random creatures or people walking around your town like it seemed a little weird that like it was specific to whatever type of race was in your system it makes sense that that would be the main uh, you know the main race of your town and whatnot but it's a settlement as it grows it should evolve and it looks like they're doing that uh, my my thoughts are like if you follow any of the notes or any of the things that uh, hello games or Sean Murray says they literally said this is just a small update to them but it it, it is it's putting something in place that is uh, meant for something bigger bigger later so I have a feeling that this is all just tip of the iceberg stuff and they're trying to get all the bugs worked out and get it smoothed out because what they're really going to do with it is a lot bigger. And so right now we're just getting a little taste of it and then until then, you know, we just got to wait and deal with the bugs and stuff and, until they work it out. And they will. They really will. Uh, they're probably the best team when it comes to breaking and fixing their own game. Because they know when they fix it, they're going to break it. And they know when they fix those breaks, they're going to break it more. So, like, they already set themselves up for failure when they put out any kind of update or patch. They know what they're doing. So, just be patient. And they will blow through all the bugs. And they will fix pretty much all of the things that can be fixed. 
Otherwise, 3.66 out on consoles now. Uh, like I said, last video, read the patch notes if you want it. Otherwise, have fun. See you out there in space, guys. Love you. Bye.